This tutorial will walk you through entering a partial payment for vendor invoice for a project purchase order. This should be used when you are paying for only some of the components on the purchase order at this time. Select the Documents and Accounting menu, then select Project View. Click on the plus sign next to the project you are entering the vendor invoice for. Click on the plus sign next to the Purchase and Work Orders folder. Then click to highlight the purchase order to enter the vendor invoice against. Select the Vendor Invoice button up at the top. Here you can enter a vendor invoice number. Use the date if you do not have one. Enter your vendor invoice date and optionally a transaction description. Some people like to use a short description about the component they are paying for at this time. Next, you can highlight the component that you are paying for and select the pencil to edit if there are any cost differences from the PO and the invoice you have received. If not, move on and highlight the component that you do not wish to pay for at this time. In this example, we are not paying for the freight component on this invoice. It is going to be billed at a later date. Click on the pencil to edit the component cost and change it to zero. Also, be sure that the quantity paid for is also zero. Then select OK. Edit any other components that you're not paying for at this time to make them zero as well. Be sure that the subtotal matches the full cost of what the component you're paying for is at this time. If you previously sent a deposit for this component, the vendor may have only used some of that deposit towards this item. Edit the less deposit amount to show only the amount the vendor applied. The amount due field should be exactly what you need to pay at this time. Up at the top, be sure to pick the proper pay with type and then select OK to enter the invoice. If your pay type was check, the invoice will now be on your pay bills and checkbook tab so you can write a check. This concludes our tutorial for entering a partial vendor invoice against a project purchase order. To review more tutorials and search our knowledge base articles, please visit our Help Center under the support menu of designmanager.com.